You may have heard that Marine Terminal 28, also known as the Cinespace Studios, will be closing its doors on February 21st, 2007. Knowing that this would have such a negative impact on Toronto's film industry, there's only one question to ask. Why are they being closed? We do, we do feel that the new Portland studio that's supposed to be opening in the next 12 to 15 months has everything to do with the fact that we were not relocated. The city of Toronto and even the province have been pushing the agenda of a mega studio in Toronto for seven, eight years now. And unfortunately, none of them have ever come to fruition. I called Ted Coe and spoke to one of the representatives who told me why it is the Cinespace studio had to shut down. There was also a petition addressed to the mayor, but Cinespace received no response. Well, uh, the petition uh, voiced the concerns of uh, almost 6,000 film industry employees, but ultimately what it came down to was political will. And clearly the mayor of the city demonstrated that there was no political will to give the film industry a little bit more time to get, uh, to get back on its feet. Sadly, there was no response uh, to uh, to the petition or to the package of producers' letters that we put together to the mayor, which is confusing and frustrating for us at the same time. The effect of the closing of this facility with no replacement space is more a film industry issue than it is a company issue for us. And that's because the film industry will lose four studios or 140,000 square feet of film production space with no replacement. That means that uh, the city of Toronto is typically strapped for film studio space and what this means is that we, we will be turning away projects to other jurisdictions and when you turn away film projects uh, producers have unfortunately a long memory they will remember that they called Toronto and there wasn't enough studio space for them to do their project in. Hopefully we'll try to place them in one of our um, other facilities or hopefully um, uh, they, they can find somewhere else to shoot in Toronto. Again, this is not a Cinespace issue, a company issue, as much as it's an industry issue. It's still a win for the city of Toronto if the movie Saw 4, which was slated to be shot in this building in the next couple of months, it would be a win for Toronto if that movie could find a place uh, to stay anywhere in Toronto to, to shoot here. So it's clear David Miller isn't particularly concerned with the closing of the Cinespace studios. No one knows how much this will affect Toronto's film industry. Only time will tell. This is Randall Medford, The Journal.